typically you're focusing on improvement as a unit and individually. This time, I guess it's just a reminder of why you started playing the game. Just enjoying the game again. No real, no real goals at the end, which is a bit strange, but it's been good for me convincing myself I could get back and I had a lot of people tell me or ask me why I was still playing. Um, if I was interested in coming back from the injury again and really tested how much I cared about the game and the team and what we're doing here. Getting fit and coming back just for the season to be taken away, it just shows you not everything's always in your control. And so I guess I had a choice to be upset about not having the whole right off in the sunset moment and just look at it as more of an enjoyable experience. I didn't get to play my best football at the NBC, right? Um, I was learning and then I got hurt. And then I learned a lot while I was hurt. And there was a massive part of me that was like, oh, I'll show you to whoever doubted me, even to myself, really, or to my family and friends and stuff, just for people to see me play my best football. The things I've learned being a Timberwolf, I've, I've learned far more off the pitch that sure I've become a better footballer or whatever but I've become a way better man because I've been on the team so I guess that I'd want the same for my teammates the ones that have already graduated and the ones that are going to grad because that's Steve's bottom line really is I want to make better players but I want to make better people and that's why he always recruits the best people for the program and that's why our atmosphere is always so good.